what's up guys and welcome back to my channel my name is Jean and on today's tutorial I'll be showing you how to take off fabric label from your fabric okay so please guys if you're new to my channel you're welcome and do not forget to subscribe put on your notification bell so that you can notify anytime I upload a new video and if you like my video please give me a like and also put your thoughts in the comment section i'll be glad to respond to your thoughts if you have any questions or any tips or video you would want me to make please do do well to leave that in the comment section okay so moving forward i will be showing you how to take off these labels from your ankara prints okay and i have my iron and also i have the machine oil my sewing machine oil this oil is basically for your blackhead if you have a blackhead machine or a domestic machine you use it to ease friction on your machine and also use it to oil ma your machine so that your sewing machine doesn't get rusted easily so this oil is very important if you're uh, into making of dresses this oil is very important for your sewing machine just to make sure that keep the friction in your machine going smoothly all right so i'll be showing you what it looks like when you take off the label with your hot pressing iron and also with the oil okay so first of all you need to do is to plug uh, your your pressing iron on a power outlet and then when it's a little bit hot just place it on the sticker okay ironing over the sticker now after ironing over the sticker the next thing you do is just you see how easily the sticker comes off from the fabric now this method i would recommend is very very easy and fast but the only downside to this method is that the fabric glue that was used to glue the sticker on the fabric would still remain on your fabric okay so when you are you can see that the, the, the glue is still there it's not coming off the sticker only came off but the glue is still there okay so that is just the basic difference here the iron will take off the sticker but the glue residue will still be on your fabric okay so we're going to try the oil right so what you do is that next you take up your oil and then you apply it all over the sticker okay we're going to try out the oil now so i'll be placing some drops of oil on my fabric i'll place it on on top of the sticker as well as underneath the fabric okay i'll place it on top of the fabric and also underneath the fabric just to make sure that it soaks in well now you don't have to be bothered about the stain because the oil doesn't really stain the material this the fabric it won't really stain it and if you're bothered about smell what you need to do is after that you can just go ahead and wash your fabric and the oil this this the smell or the the, the order from the oil will not stick forever once you wash your fabric so now that i've applied the oil on the fabric i will just go ahead and apply a little bit more just to make it easier to come off quickly okay now after applying that oil i'll go over to the sticker and then just gradually pull out the sticker okay so i'm just spreading the oil all over the parts where the sticker covered the fabric okay now that i've done that i'll go over and take out the sticker now i've gradually pulled out the sticker now after pulling off the sticker what i discovered that is that for the oil i didn't have any um fabric glue left on my fabric unlike when i use the iron so that is just basically the only difference between these two methods if you are using your oil your machine oil on your fabric and to take off the sticker on your fabric it's it's not going to leave any um, fabric glue on your fabric and it's just going to take it off nicely but if you're using your pressing iron it will still take it off nicely but it will leave um some fabric glue left on your fabric okay so whichever method that works for you feel free to 
try it on and see whatever works for you you can go with it all right guys thank you for watching i've come to the end of the video if you like this video please give me a thumbs up and also put on the notification bell so that you get notified anytime i upload a new video i will see you in my next video bye